Hi, welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video on how to change a visor, in this case on a uh, X-Lite X803 RS. Now, this visor system is used on a couple of different uh, models through the X-Lite range. You can find those uh, models in the description below. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up the visor. All right, so. This x -Lite logo is actually a button and that's going to release the visor. So you're going to push the button in and we're just going to slide the visor forward and then lift it out. Like so, in, slide it forward. And there we go, that's that side of the visor out. Spin the helmet around, we'll do the same on this side. Again, just this button, visor away from the helmet. And that's the visor off. So if I show you the inside of the visor, you can see that these lugs here are actually like an L, and that's why we need to slide the, the visor forward. If you try and pull it straight out, you're going to snap these, and it's going to end up costing you a new visor. So make sure you, you slide it away from the helmet rather than just lifting it away from the helmet. So when we put the visor back in, we've got to uh, take the same considerations. So we will locate everything in an open visor position. So all we're going to do is push the visor down towards the back of the helmet, and the button should pretty much go back into its closed state on its own. Like so. Just give it a little wiggle and you will hear it click uh, into place. So the same on this side. Again, we'll just line everything up. And then I'm just going to push this direction. And you'll hear that snap into place. We're going to open and close the visor. Make sure it's in properly. You've got a good visor seal. The only other thing on this helmet, it does have a visor lock. So when your visor is completely shut, there is a switch here. So if you press the lower part, it locks the visor in a shut position. So on a track day, you may want to use that. Now, if you wrench the visor up, it will release itself, but obviously you don't want to risk uh, breaking it. So just make sure you release that lock before you uh, go ahead and operate the visor again. But there we go, there we have it. So that's how you change the visor on an X-Lite X803 RS. Thanks for watching.